all aseptic measures have been taken. The patient already has a stent in place. Now we are proceeding to remove the kidney stone. With the help of a guided wire, we insert a ureteral access sheath about 36 inches long through the urinary passage reaching up to the kidney. Next, a flexible ureteroscope is inserted through the sheath. This thin fiber optic or digital instrument passes through the urethra into the bladder and then carefully guided into the ureter finally reaching the kidney using my right hand i control the ureteroscope and its tip which allows us to navigate the kidney thoroughly you may also notice a white gauze piece being used here for white balance calibration the normal saline irrigation system is now running ensuring clear vision inside the kid. The flexible ureteroscope allows us to reach every K leak steer, upper, middle and lower poles of the kidney. During inspection, we locate the 18 kidney stone in the middle calyx. Smaller fragments are also seen in the inferior calyx, which are flushed out with irrigation pressure. Once the stone is located, we introduce the laser fiber, a very fine instrument about one-fifth of a millimeter in diameter. This laser beam fragments the stone, first into large pieces, then smaller fragments, and finally into fine dust. These broken particles are flushed out with saline irrigation, clearing the kidney of stones. This entire procedure is performed professionally by a urologist with the assistance of operation theater technicians.
This video is made purely for medical awareness. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more educational videos.